How's it going folks? Hope you're having a fantastic morning. We're going ice fishing today. Again, you guys have been requesting the ice fishing videos. Then again, when I upload an ice fishing video, you guys request a checking in the traps video. So today we are going ice fishing. I'm going up north, west to go hang out with John from Mendek Outdoors. And he's gonna try to put me on some juice. I'm pretty excited about it. But before we get started, I wanna say huge thanks to Mystery Tackle Box for sponsoring this video. If you guys don't know what Mystery Tackle Box is, basically it's a subscription service. They send tackle to your front doorstep every single month. You can get ice fishing, walleye, bass, panfish, catfish. There's a lot of options on there. There's elite, there's like normal, there's just a lot of great things, especially if you guys like Guggen baits. They now have Guggen baits on there. So go click the link down in the description down below and make sure you use promo code Guggen. You get $10 off your very first box. But you guys should go sign up if you're a fisherman, whether you're starting out or you're an experienced angler. I promise you, Mr. Tackle Box can help you catch more fish. And as you guys know, Christmas had just happened. Like, like yesterday, Christmas just happened. And you guys know that warm, fuzzy feeling you get when you're opening gifts on Christmas morning? Well, imagine that every single month. That's what you get with Mystery Tackle Box. Every single month you get a surprise box of fishing baits. Every single month that you get to open, just like Christmas morning. If you guys want to experience Christmas morning every single month, go sign up for Mystery Tackle Box. But I'm gonna shut up. We gotta go ahead, like I said, north, a couple hours or so, but we're going after something a little bit interesting. You guys just stay tuned. Ooh, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's actually morning, I know. I, use, I say good morning no matter what time of day it is, but it's cold out here, it is morning, it is 6.32 a.m. We're gonna grab some gas, but look at this. Look, we're out, we'll look what we're doing today. Is this thing charged? Two bars, all right, we gotta, we gotta be careful. We might wanna change the battery on that bad boy. Only two bars, I got one though, I got one in the truck, we're good. We'll be good. But we got Klamisha, so we're good. And we got Mindak, so obviously we're always gonna catch fish because he's always dialed on dialed. The, the biggest and the baddest fish in South Dakota, right? But we gotta grab some gas, and then we're gonna try something that I've never done before in my entire life. Um, really, really hoping it works, but gonna try to catch. Oh, actually, I'm not even gonna tell ya. You guys are just gonna have to stay tuned because, I mean, there's probably a lot of different species that we could catch in this video, but there's specifically one that I'm after that uh, I've never caught through the ice before. So we're gonna grab some gas, grab some food, get on the road. We got like an hour, hour and 30, hour and 40, and then we're gonna be hopefully catching some fish. You guys stay tuned. Made it to the bait store here up in South Dakota. All cheese and rice. What do we got going on here? Do you, do you get anything else besides? I don't know. Uh, Is there frostbite here? Oh, Let's play socks. Yeah. What are you cooking with your boys? Oh, yeah. We'll get, we'll get some of those chubs. How many chubs? We'll do a dozen, do, do a dozen chubs. Everybody loves a good chub. And 11, one more. Nice one. Ooh, that's a cool oh, Baja. Oh, okay, I got it. Okay, okay. 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 Alright, 12. Oh, yeah, those are the best. Those, those, are, good. those are good size ones. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah I'll we'll just scoop, okay. scoop a root of those. Yeah. Yeah. Beauty. What's that thing you're holding? <laughs> this guy? Camera. What are you taking a picture in the middle for? Uh, YouTube videos. Documenting our catches. Yeah. I wouldn't know if I didn't ask. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yep. Oh, I like these can't. Dude, these are the move. Why doesn't everybody have them in these? Because I have like the little like flimsy ones and they crunch. Yeah, no, these ones. These are, are the good. move. Because you can like reuse them too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, botch. Some Christmas cookies. I'm watching the figure. I'm watching the figure. But it's barrel season. God, you're right. It it's is always <laughs> barrel season, baby. <laughs> it's barrel season. Dozen chubs and a scoop of fat nights. What are you guessing out of 10? What do you think this one's going to be? Well, I'm guessing it's going to be bad since you're the one that put it in the microwave. I don't, I don't trust you. I mean, I've seen worse. Mm. It's alright. About a four and a half. Okay, I think there is. <laughs> I'm ready. Whew, 
finally, 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 finally made it out. Uh, finally made it out to the middle, middle of this freaking lake. We should have drove, should have drove the Yoda out here. We definitely should have, but. I mean, I just wasn't too sure about the ice, but I'm gonna get the tip ups rock and roll. You guys kinda know the drill by now. I mean, I haven't made a ton of ice fishing videos, but if you're tuning in for the first time, big tip up guy here. John, nah, not a big tip up guy. He's the jigging guy, I'm the tip up guy. We kinda go back and forth, but I'm gonna go get set up four tip ups out here, and uh, we're just gonna kinda space them out, and we'll see. We're literally in the middle of this lake. I don't know if I've quite ice fished like this before, where you literally are just in the middle of a lake, and here we're gonna be jigging, and we've got some chubs, we got some Minnows, I'll probably do two chubs, two minnows on the tip ups, kind of mix it up a little bit, but we're just gonna kind of spread them out and see what happens. All right, here's the first hole. I have no idea how deep it is. Not even gonna bring the vex out. We're just gonna get these boys rocking and rolling here. All right, we got a little homemade tip up action. If you guys want to see how to make these, let me know. Felix actually hooked it up fat, dropped off a couple more of these for me for this trip. If you guys don't know who Felix is, he's the guy who makes these these tip ups for me, and they're absolute units. And uh, I think I think he's down down to teach you guys how to make them. You guys just gotta let me know if it's something that you guys really want to see. I'll, I can include it in an ice fishing video one day. But we're gonna drop this bad boy down. See what we're dealing with here. So how these things work is I put a sounder weight on it, go all the way to the bottom, and then right where right where it gets tight, I'm gonna pinch right here, pull up. So that's about a foot distance. And tie this little loopy knot. I know if you guys have been watching my ice fish videos, this is super repetitive, but this is for those of you guys that have not seen these before. That's how you do it. Then bring the weight back up. Oh, we're we're probably 10, 15 feet at least here. I'm gonna hook this guy right behind the dorsal. Hopefully that hook's big enough. I don't know. We'll find out. So I'm gonna drop a couple of these down just for the chance of pike, giant bass, giant walleye, pretty much anything. We'll get this guy all the way down there, chilling. Feed the line all the way back down the hole, and that way, that way, when he settles down and kind of sinks down to the bottom, he'll be about a foot off, foot off the bottom or so. Then you take the loop you made, set it on there. That way, when the fish pulls, the flag goes up, and then the line can go and it's free spool. That way, you know the fish don't feel it, and you come over and you yank them up. So that's how we're gonna rig this guy up. One down, three to go. Big chub, big chub is up. Big chub, like a giant chub. Uh oh. We got first tip up. Before, I couldn't even get that last tip up up before this one went off. This is the big chub, like a big, big chub. I'm gonna let him run for a minute. The only thing that scares me is uh, if it's a pike, I'm probably gonna lose it. All right, it stopped. I don't know if there's a fish there or not. That's the loop. I think it dropped it. Oh, shoot. We should have hit it sooner, I guess gone it got it he got the chub that's a botch sorry right, we got more we'll put another one on there so i don't know how it, i don't know how it would have just ripped i mean it must have just ripped it off but that was a big fish if if i mean i don't know what it was but put another one down there it's a good sign though i literally was setting the last tip up up and one went off so Let's see if we can get another one. Oh, how is it in here, Jimmy? She's nice and warm in here. Don't, wow. don't even have the heater on. This It is really warm in here. Oh, yeah. Kalisha keeps it hot, eh? Yep. Well, we got all the tip-ups finally set out. We had two false alarms during that little segment, but now we're gonna start jigging. Doing a little jigging with Jordan out here. All right, here we go. What's this thing called? The... Oh, VMC the rattle. rattle spoon. Oh, it has a rattle in it. Yeah, I, I said. Well, that's like low key lit, dude. Okay. Well, uh, I'm gonna do a minnow head. Gotcha. You're, aren't you doing the doing waxies? waxies? Yeah. You're doing waxies, waxies, so I'll do the minnow head. John and I are just gonna sit in that old shack. Oh. Do some jigging. You gotta. Oh, you gotta oh, mark. I'm gonna get marked. Uh oh. Uh oh. Got him. Gotta be a small jaw, dude. You're already hooked up. Hard, first first drop. drop. First drop. I haven't even put my line in the water. What do we got? It's pretty clear right there. What are we what are we what are we working with here folks? First can't drop. What are these suspended, dude? Oh that's a good one, huh? Yeah. Really? Some pretty good head shakes. Really? Oh yeah. What are we doing? Small jaw. Oh, oh that's a oh, good yeah, small yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh shoot! Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding! I know. He's right under, he's right by your deucey. You gotta be kidding. Oh my gosh, dude. That's a tank. That's a freaking know, tank dude, on that the, was first the first drop. drop. What? All right, all right. get out of take here. Take her easy. Oh, work his head out. Oh, oh my <laughs> gosh! You have got to be joking boys, right now. First drop. It's about to be a good day, oh boys. Oh my gosh. Oh snap. Oh my gosh. That's what we came here for. That was the secret fish, folks. 
was a smallmouth. I've never caught one under the ice before, ever. It hey, look, first drop, dude. That took ten seconds. Dude, that's decent. That's this could be good. This, this is gonna be good. I think you need to go waxies now. I th okay, I got just talking yeah, about yeah, yeah, I, heads, I gotta but... do waxies. I gotta do oh, waxies, man, dude. dude. What? That's decent, dude. That's, that's a like nice that's like three. Yeah, that's that's, a, that's probably a three that's pounder. Three. That's a three pounder right there, 16, 17 incher. That's Let's a beauty, go. baby. Let's Whee! go, dude. Well, Here, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna John Merks, and uh, oh, we're gonna rig up the old rattler with a wax wax daddy. We're gonna call you. I think the move here is gonna put three three waxies, one on each hook. That was the John Lehman special, just like that. Look at that. Look at that trifecta of just yummy goodness. I would eat that. If I was a smallie, I'd eat it. Oh wait. Oh, the flag up. Flag, 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 flag. Yay! Oh, it just cracked right under me. This is the minnow. It's frozen. It didn't run very far. I can see the knot still. Oh, it's still there, though. It's still there, though. Got him. Got him. I'm hooked up. I'm hooked up. Walleye! <laughs> what the heck? Look at that. He choked it, son. What was that? Did you hear him? He like hissed at me. <laughs> oh! Is he hissing? Yeah! Looky there, folks. First fish for me is a walleye. John just caught a smallmouth. This is the biggest walleye I've ever caught through the ice. You believe that? Clearly, I'm not from South Dakota, but get this guy back in the water. Not dinner fair today, boys. See you later. All right, here we go. First drop. Just caught a walleye. Haven't even dropped down on him yet. Got him. I'm hooked up. I'm hooked up. I'm hooked up. Okay, we got a fish. We got a fish. Here we go. It doesn't feel that big though. I'll be honest with you. It doesn't feel all that big. It's a perch. It's a perch. That's what we're dealing with. That's what we're dealing with, Jim. Tip up, tip up, tip up. Tip up. Oh, snap. Oh, snap, crackle, pop. Hang on. Let me get you off real quick. We got a tip up going on right now. That's what we're dealing with. See you later, bud. No catch and cook today. Yay! What are we doing here? Oh, yeah. Dang it, it dropped. Dude, I can't catch up. I can't catch up. I hooked it, and it came flying up at me. I couldn't catch it. Oh, that's like the third time today. It's like you go and you set it, but it's like the second you set it, they run straight at the hole and I can't, I can't line them up in time. Son of a gun. Well, I mean, at least I caught a perch, I guess, but miss something. Go get another chip. There's one. That's a fish. That's a fish. It feels, a be it feels better. You want to pull the vex? I don't, it, may, it may not be a smallie, but it feels better than that perch for sure. Oh, that's sick. Wasn't rolling the GoPro. Thought I had a nice little smallie on. I mean, to be honest, these are pretty chunky though. I mean, compared to the ones the other day, I mean, they're these guys are fatties. But not what we're after. We gotta find. We gotta find where these small jaws are. These perch are not doing it for me right now. I mean, if we were doing a perch catch and cook, that'd be one thing, but we are not. So. These guys, not gonna do the trick. A few moments later. Well, we're moving. Uh, so far, we have been skirted by the small jaws. Other than the first drop, John caught a good one. That's like, literally, that's exactly what we're after out here. That's why we came all the way up here. But, so far, haven't had another one. Just some perch and a little waller. But, we're just gonna drag the shack across the lake a little bit, try to find a new, new honey hole here. I don't know. We'll see how it goes, I guess. We don't have a whole lot of time left. Uh, before we gotta head back home, but we gotta catch some small jaws. That's what I came here for. We need to catch some small jaws. Got something. Feels stinky. Little perch. Wow. Man, what a day. 
2,000 years later. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as you can tell, I am back home and better than ever with the homie. What's up, my dude? Hey, hey. Oh, oh, you want to show everybody your new trick? Okay, okay, chill, 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 chill. My goodness. Sit. Shake. Oh, <laughs> good boy. I don't have a treat for you. I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. You're just trying to shake a lot for camera. You're just trying to show off. Yeah, you're so smart. Everybody gets it. You can chill now. Just just chill. Just chill. Yep, chill. But hopefully you guys enjoyed today's ice fishing video. Like I said, I'm back home. And now we got to go check the traps. I went from Nebraska all the way up north to go ice fishing. Now we got to go back down south an hour to go check the traps. We're going to be doing that in a later video. So if you guys want to see that, tune in to the next episode of Fishing with Flair. But like I said, if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like on this video. Let me know what you guys, what else you guys want to see. What other ice fishing adventures you guys would like to see catching cooks i feel like i've been doing a lot of those are you good bro but if you guys have any other ideas let me know in the comments section down below really do appreciate the view peace